Hi, welcome to the backyard. I'm Taylor. And I'm Tyler. And uh, this week's episode, we're going to be talking about uh, some of the newer products we got in and, and that the time of the year it is, you know, getting out there hunting with your dogs and then also some seed um, on the other side of it, you know, getting those discounts when you can and whatnot there. Um, first thing though is this Taste of the Wild here. Um, these are their two new ones that we have in. We do have their other five. That's what's nice about Taste of the Wild. Only five, five bags, now seven um, in their whole line. You know, a lot of other companies might have, you know, hundreds, some even Blue Wilderness, Blue Buffalo might even have a thousand, I don't even know. Um, but, but these two grain-free uh, formulas, this one is the venison and legumes. Um, very good. This, they're all uh, grain-free, like I said. Um, a lot of dogs are going that way um, because of allergies and, and things like that. So this is the first one here, venison and legumes. And the second one here is a small breed formula. And with that, Ty, you were saying kind of earlier, yeah, the kibble size. Yeah, if you a dog uh, that doesn't like the nickel size kibbles or, or mm -hmm. the bigger kibbles, th this is going to be absolutely, not tiny, but, but easier to, to, for a small breed. You know, if you got a little chihuahua, it's going to be a lot easier for them yeah. to uh, break down and digest. Yeah, you don't want them chomping on those nickel quarter nope. sizes. That's exactly what this is. So it's just a small breed. Uh, venison and garbanzo beans. Garbanzo beans. So uh, beans are the the hot item, I guess, deer and beans. So, mm -hmm. You know, if you're going deer hunting and that's what you're going to have, Fido gets to have that. Too. Yeah, and you know, like we said, grain free. Yep. Um, and that's the so. wild's been really good for us. Yep. We started with a couple bags and. Um, and their whole line yeah. is grain free. So, yeah, that's uh, the two new bags they got in there. So, pretty cool. Uh, Taste of the wild. Some other stuff here with that type of season going on. This is a skid plate. Um, it's meant to protect your dog's chest uh, and stomach from all those areas uh, you know, where it's hit the hardest when they're out in the field and the swamps and all there. You don't always know what's up. Fence posts and whatnot could come underneath. This is a, a skid plate that's meant to go right underneath them and, and help keep them protected. Um, it's very important to do that. Keep care, uh, keep care of those dogs. And then some other things here before Ty talks about that. Just some other things we have in for your hunting dog. Uh, this is an orange dummy canvas. Um, go practice, get some retrieving in. If you don't want the canvas, we do have the plastic ones here too, um, along with some other things as well. But uh, you got that canine restart. Well, you know, if you're pushing your dogs, if uh, they're getting going and, and they're having a long day hunting, keep them hydrated. And then uh, if you need uh, maybe a little extra energy or you think that they're looking a little tired, but, uh, this is all it is. It's a little uh, energy and sports formula. It's called canine restart. Um, from our good guys at SciTech Premixes, we work with them uh, on the, on the uh, mm -hmm. calf and dairy side of things. But um, yeah, it, it's a great product, but it's specifically for uh, you know en energizing, uh, kind of rehydrating that dog. So if uh, you know it's going to be a long day, you're going to South Dakota or wherever, and you know it's going to be a long day hunting, it's not a bad product to, to try out. Mm -hmm. Check that dog a little bit. And then of course, Canine Balancer, um, a once a day, once a day supplement, that's going to help them out too. Yeah, we um, said that a lot. You know, we've yep. brought it up with here in the store and on Facebook and our website. But it's it's true. It, it's done really well for us. We're getting a lot of good response, and, and we're excited to keep pushing that and see where we can yep. go with it. And then of course we got uh, we got tingly boots. We got some barn boots, um, some winter boots. But we also got these reed uh, thinsulate. I'll kind of bring them out here. They're for water. You. They're waterproof. And then we got last year's uh, Ranger boots. But um, good price on those. Really good product. Mm -hmm. And you know we don't have a big line of it, but we we do have it is a good product at a good price so if you're you're stopping in kind of take a peek if you know what you're needing mm -hmm. and then the last thing um seed seed the next discount period most likely november 15th for most seed companies um feel free to come in and talk with us we sell dairyland seed rob seco seed wolf river um and alpharex alpharex mm -hmm. is brand new for us uh, we brought them all on for to fill out kind of everything that you need you know your soil type um what you're going to do with the corn if you're going to feed it if you're going to sell it um if you're going to chop it for silage so we, we got all sorts of options for you and kind of exciting, Alpharex is actually the company that has uh, the Hygest 360 low lignin alfalfa yep. um, first on the market. Mm -hmm. it, it's extremely limited supply, but we are going to have um, yep. a decent supply of it. If you need that stuff, if you want to try that out, you got to let us know pretty yeah, early. Get a hold of us as soon as you can. On the other hand, Dairyland Hyperforce 3400, that was a big product for us last, mm -hmm. last year. Um, we're going to have... Hopefully a bigger availability of what we had last year. We sold a pile of it last year, yep. but I know some of you guys maybe had to go to 2400 or uh, maybe make them seven. If you want 3400, let us know. We're going to be mm -hmm. able to handle that. So we got awesome options in alfalfa, awesome options in uh, corn silage, and then the grain prices uh, just came in too. So we have prices for you if you want to come 
uh, check us out. Dairyland does 11% by November uh, 15th. I know, I think Rob Seco does 8% around that November 15th. So, you know, you, you might have just harvested some Give beans, us a call, got some you know? money. Let Give us, us a know. call. Um, talk with me, Jerry, Mike, Tay, mm -hmm. Bo. Um, you name it. Lori, La last thing here, Lori. too, uh, when we're wrapping up, October is Adopt a Dog Month. So if you guys are thinking about getting a dog out there, go take a look at your area shelter. Go go take a look at a rescue. And uh, these dogs need need help, you know. And if you're really looking at it, go be a hero. And, you know, think about go t go adopting a dog. It means a lot. And, and there's a lot out there. There's definitely a lot out there. Um, so, yeah, it's October. That's, a, that's Adopt a Dog yeah, we Month. we got rescues that come to us. Mm -hmm. You know, um, we have a really good breeder that comes to us that, uh, they have some huge labs, some, mm -hmm. some absolutely huge labs they have a lot of luck with. But mm -hmm. if you're looking for a, a, a dog or a puppy, uh, yeah, let us know. We can hopefully help you out. Yeah, so okay. check us out on the website, uh, thebackyardperm.com. Keep us up, uh, up to date on Facebook and Twitter.